Hi there, so in this video we are going to take a look at linked list in vb.net. So linked list is generic doubly linked list in vb. It allows sequential access within your linked list. Okay, so first thing open Visual Studio and create one vb.net console application and you will have module empty such as this. Now inside your main subroutine I want you to write one link list nums dim nums as new linked list. Let me just correct the spelling here. Okay, now here, okay, so for off, here we make use of integer. Okay, you can choose character or string if you want. Now for addition into that linked list, I'm going to use nums dot add first or last. You can choose last if you want. So I'm going to use add last for let's say four times. Okay, and that's how I'm going to fill my linked list. I'm going to add numbers such as 22. 32 and final 42 so gap of 10 in between each okay now I'm going to access each of these elements from link list using for each and then num as integer in nums and then use console a right line and then num to be iterated through this link list okay now let's just run this and check out how it works okay so that exited because we didn't add it console a dot read and now that it is saved let me run this again okay so as you can see uh, it will sequentially access this from top to bottom so the first entry that we added using add last was 12 then 22 32 and then 42 okay now you can also remove element from your link list using nums dot and then remove and specify let's say 22 Okay, and then you try to iterate through it, then it will just get rid of this entry and rest of the three numbers will be displayed. Okay, so let's run this and check out. Okay, so as you can see, I have removed 22 from this linked list and it is now showing that change. Okay, so this was a short video on a linked list in vb.net.